since it was about Mexican art, I really like looking back and seeing all the pre-Columbian art yeah. and the stuff that they did. Really, really. Absolutely. Well, that's fantastic. Well, did you two happen to see any of the works that you saw today in your classrooms, like through Rooks and Pins? Yes, I saw all three pieces. Three pieces, really. Well, how did those works differ from what you saw today? Did they, like, through detail, or was anything bigger or smaller than you expected? Well, we saw it, like, on the laptop, so it was a lot different. Mm -hmm. It was a lot brighter and stuff. Yeah. see more detail on the green. Yeah, so it really changed in your perception? And some of the colors were a little bit different, too, how it was shaded. So you would see some stuff here that you couldn't see in the book. Mm -hmm. so. Definitely. That's great. Well, to finish off, um, or is there any particular work that you saw in the gallery that was your absolute favorite? I saw the boy and the dog. The boy and the dog. Why was that your favorite? I just thought it was cool because like he looked so free and like there's nothing out there. Yeah, that's a great answer. I liked um, the border crossing mm -hmm. because it was kind of symbolizing that him and his wife and his whole family were one unit and they were together and he was going to protect them no matter what. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are both really great answers. Well, thank you so much for taking time to talk to